Do I look like a dad on vacation in like Hawaii though or something like that? I feel like that's what I look like, but I'm digging it. Also, I can see it now. This dad on vacation is probably just like, got his home movie camera, filming his family or like whatever, and he's just like, yep, there's the ocean. Hello, good morning, good evening, and good night. My name is Dalton Kaufman, if you did not already know that. Okay, good, glad we got that cleared out of the way. Now we can get on to the video. Today, I feel like it's gonna be a little bit of a rant. This has been an issue that's been bothering me lately, um, and it's been an issue my whole entire life, and like, I'm sick and tired of it, and I don't wanna deal with it anymore. Now yes, you may be thinking, oh, this sounds like a very serious issue. Like. What could it possibly be? Is it that serious? No, I'm just very overdramatic. Anyway, without further ado, I would like to talk about the toilet seat. <laughs> if you're a guy and you've ever lived with a girl, a wife, a friend, girlfriend, whatever, or if you're a girl and you've ever lived with a guy, vice versa, you know, you have most likely experienced this problem. And I don't know if I'm the only one that gets mad about it, but <laughs> sometimes I just get livid. So all my whole entire life growing up, I have a mom that I lived with for 18 years. And every time she would go to the bathroom after I was done using the bathroom, she would yell at me. Now you may be asking, why would she yell at you after using the bathroom? Did you like pee on the floor or something? Yes, I did. <laughs> yes, I did that when I was a small child. But that's not why she yelled at me. She yelled at me because I didn't put the toilet seat back down so she didn't have to put it down when she wanted to go pee and sit on the toilet. Now, personally, that has been happening my whole entire life. I always get yelled at that. Put the toilet seat down when you're done. Put it down when you're done. You have to put it down when you're done. And then I moved away and I had the best two years of my life because I had my own bathroom. I could do whatever I wanted in my bathroom. I didn't have to worry about putting the toilet seat up, putting it down, nothing. It was just me and it was pure bliss. And now, I live in an apartment with my roommate, Dubraska, who, <laughs> I'll put a picture or something. Many of you probably know. And she is a woman and I am a man. And we share a bathroom. We only have one bathroom. And the other day, I went to the bathroom. I went and peed. And then right after, she went to the bathroom. And she, she before she went, she said, Dalton, come here. I gotta show you something. I was like, oh my gosh, what is, <laughs> what, what is in the bathroom that you have to jump me? I'm a little scared. And I go to the bathroom and she goes, look. <sighs> Slam the toilet seat down. It takes two seconds. One, two, she did and put the toilet seat in said, she said it takes two seconds. So I said, you know what? Watch this. And I lifted it back up and I said, one, two, it takes two seconds to put it back up when you're done. And that is my dilemma. Why is it that guys always get yelled at and have to put the toilet seat down whenever they're done using the bathroom? So if I have to put the toilet seat down when I'm done going to the bathroom, then you best believe that girl, you need to put that toilet seat back up whenever you're done using the bathroom. I don't have time to put it down and then put it up when I wanna go. I have places to go and people to see. I don't have time to do that. If I have to put it down, then you have to put it up. E equality, isn't that like a thing? Why should I take the time out of my day to help you if you're not gonna help me? You know, this is like a world, if you scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. All I'm saying is, if I have to put the toilet seat down, then you have to put it up. It's a lot harder to put it up than put it down. When you put it down, you just have to go, bloop, 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 bloop. But to put it up, you have to bend over, you have to touch it, like grab it, and then you have to use your strength in your arms, in your body, to pull it up. That's a lot harder. Anyway, that's it. That's what my video is for today because I'm a POS and this has really been bothering me lately on a very minuscule level, but I'm very overdramatic. If you have ever met me, you know that. So, but let me know. Do you think if, if a guy has to put the toilet seat down after they're done using the bathroom, shouldn't a girl have to put it up when they're done? 
I mean, that's just logic. It lo makes logical sense, right? Am I wrong? I don't think so. Let me know what you think. <laughs> because I don't want to be the only one that sounds like an asshole. <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, make sure that you like it, you subscribe to it, you share it. I know it, you know it, I'm freaking hysterical, the whole world should know it. So give it a big old share, and I don't know, I'll see you next week. Vacation Dad is out. <laughs>